The Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, the IPCC, in its sixth assessment report, recognizes that there are some 15 to 16 tipping element systems, large biophysical systems that scientifically are proven to regulate the climate system on planet Earth, but also that they have multiple stable states separated by tipping points. Push them too far and they can shift irreversibly. The Green Ice Sheet, the Amazon Rainforest, the West Antarctic Ice Shelf, the permafrost systems are a few of these systems. In the science paper that we just published, for the first time, we're now able to scientifically quantify the temperature levels when we are at risk of pushing these tipping elements across tipping points. What we find is that several of them are at risk already today at 1.1 degrees Celsius warming and that we enter high risk of crossing tipping points at 1.5 degrees Celsius. Furthermore, we show that science now shows that we cannot exclude domino effects. Across one of them, they can push in a cascade mode the risk of crossing tipping points on others. I'm actually now on one of these tipping element systems. I've been sailing down from the Arctic Circle which is warming four times faster than the planet on average. The Greenland ice sheet, if it would melt, would irreversibly commit all future generations to seven meter sea level rise. The ocean around us here, the North Atlantic, with the ocean overturning of heat, is slowing down fast by 15% and is one of the tipping element systems that regulates regional weather patterns across the Northern Hemisphere. Our assessment is that the green ice sheet and the overturning of heat in the ocean are at risk at 1.5 degrees Celsius. At this assessment, we also include risks of crossing tipping points to the Amazon rainforest, the tropical coral reef systems, the permafrost systems already at 1.5. This means that 1.5 degrees Celsius is not some arbitrary negotiated number in the Paris Accord, it is a planetary boundary. It is something that we cannot negotiate. It is a level we really need to try and hold as far as we ever can. That is what science shows in this work.